Crete is one of the biggest islands in the Mediterranean Sea. With its mild winters and warm summers, it provides the perfect conditions for the olive trees to grow. In the region of Yerapetra in southeastern Crete, the variety cultivated is called Koroneiki. The olives are small, like beans, and suitable for the production of olive oil. In February, after the harvest, the olive trees are pruned. The new branches that will grow will have more and better olives. After the pruning, it's time to fertilize. In the summer months, it never rains in the region of Yerapetra, so the trees must be watered. The olive tree is very resilient. It can survive the most extreme conditions and it can live for hundreds of years. With proper care, olive trees can produce more olive oil. The greatest enemy that affects the harvest and the quality of the olive oil is the fruit fly. Farmers use traps since pesticides are forbidden. The harvest period begins in December and ends in February. Farmers use rods to bring the olives down and nets to gather them together. They put the olives in sacks and take them to the olive oil factory. Here we are in the second agricultural cooperative in Yerapetra. In this factory, olives are turned into olive oil. The sacks are emptied into a large container where the leaves are separated from the olives. Then the olives are washed. When olives are washed with water temperature less than 27 degrees centigrade, the quality of the olive oil is better. After that, the olives are crushed and turned into pulp. The pulp is being mixed for about two hours. This makes the extraction of the olive oil easier. Each large mixing bowl has the name of the farmer on it so that they know who the oil belongs to. When the pulp is ready, the lever of the bowl is pulled and the pulp goes into a machine that extracts the oil and separates the water from the waste. The 
waste is not thrown away. It is turned into low quality palmer soil and fuel. The olive oil is put into different kinds of containers depending on what the farmer wants. You get about one liter of olive oil out of five kilos of olives. A sample is taken to determine the quality of the oil. You drop a special solution into the sample. The number of drops added before the sample changes color determines the acidity. Three drops means that the acidity is 0.3, that is, top quality extra virgin olive oil. An oil rich in nutrients and antioxidants, very important in the Mediterranean diet. An oil recommended by doctors because it helps us live a long and healthy life. Eat the wheat!